Uh, Ryan, there was a lot on the line tonight for the Estacado Matadors. They've yet to pick up a road win. They're down a few guys, and the district title is on the line. If they can get the win tonight over Leveland, the Matadors will get at least a share of the district title for the second year in a row. And this matchup with the Lobos always comes with high stakes. Typically, this is the game that determines who wins district. And these two teams have really gone back and forth over the past couple years. Leveland winning in 18. Estacado with a big win last year, 42 to 12. And Coach Cluley says the adversity his team has faced early on, dropping their first three games, has really prepared his team for big moments like this and for the postseason. They throw the ball extremely well. Um, they, they can run the ball. Uh, they got explosive athletes at, at all different types of positions. It's about competing. It's about next man up mentality. Um, you know, we have a lot of really good players on this football team, and though we may not have the full contingent of our 40 kids, the you know. 30-ish that we have that are rolling down to wherever we go with us, we feel really good about it. So winning a district championship is your, your first goal that you set out to do, you know, and um, um, that's the one that to me is if you can reach that one, you get the one seed in the playoffs. Because we've worked so hard, we, we put pressure on ourselves. I tell our kids, like, nervousness is okay, you know. it's uh, Nervousness means that you've worked hard enough that you might lose something that you don't want to lose. If you haven't worked for anything, why would you have any reason to be nervous? Now, both these teams played Perryton for their last game. Estacado with a big win last week with an interception and a touchdown in the fourth quarter. And for the Lobos, they dropped their game to Perryton 34-7. So it'll be up to the Matadors to see if they can carry the momentum from last week's win into tonight's game and pick up their first road win. Now, kickoff is in about 30 minutes. And, of course, Ryan, we'll have highlights for this game tonight at 10. But for now, I'll go ahead and send it back to you in studio.